Hello there, this is Ben Fournier and here's more Freelancer. I think I'm going to try and see if I can mine some asteroids in the asteroid field nearby the station I'm at already. And then take on a mission. So, let's see if it's possible and if it's actually worthwhile. Because trying to do trading seems to not be as easy to do if I'm going to keep getting swarmed by pirates all the time. So yeah, there's all these guys to talk to. Maybe let's talk to them first. We've spoken before, haven't we? Good memory. I'm Trent. I remember you. Good to see you again, Mr. Trent. Good to be back. So tell me what you got. Well, just between us, I have heard a rumor. Yeah? What's up? Okay, here's what's going on. You think the outcasts are bad? You should try going up against the Corsair. They're the meanest lads I've ever encountered. They make the mollies look like schoolyard bullies. Once we left Freydstad with a convoy of 11, by the time the Corsairs were finished with us, there were only five ships that limped into Cambridge over a week later. So, yep. Interesting. Thanks. Very well. Be seeing you. That's fun. Okay, and the uh, guy that wants me to pay him money... Yeah, Britannia mining and metal, that's work there, this one. We have met, haven't we? Yeah, call me Trent. Of course, it's very, very nice to see you. Good to be seen. Anything going on? Sure, I could pass along a rumor I know. How's that? All right, go on. Fine, this is what I heard. I'm only telling you this because you're a trusted friend of BMM. Some of the mocks produced at LD-14 is shipped to this base. You know, mocks contain some... A, uh, yeah. A, well, that means you can't let the mollies get their hands on it. They have threatened to make stuff and do stuff. Okay. Interesting. Thanks. Next time, Trent. Alright, yeah, let's go out and see if I can mine stuff. Because that would be nice if I don't have to waste all my countermeasures on getting swarmed away Freelance pirates all the time. One -1. This is Stokes Smelter. Everything's go for launch. Good journey. Alright, so we are right by an asteroid field. So let's see. If we can remove some of these asteroids and collect their stuff. Come on, what is here? Can we? Is this going to do anything? Doesn't seem to be. Well, that didn't seem to gather anything. Oh, come on. And now there's more jerks. What the heck? Great. Well, now there's jerks that are a fair bit out. Oh, come on. Well, I want to just go back here, and I can't. Dude, chill, seriously. Oh, fine. Well, I guess I can't just mine like I thought I could. That is something in Starpoint Gemini that I actually like is being able to just mine any random asteroid. Evidently, there's another system to it in this. I don't know what it is, but I am not liking how I can't just do that generally. Oh well, I guess those are just decorative though. A decorative random crap in the universe. Yeah, well chill out. You wanted to go crispy, you're gonna go crispy. Go crispy. Oh my word. Stop. Oh come on. Stop, stop, stop. Stop moving. Go crispy. 
Yeah, well, it stopped. Come on, there we go. And they are 1000k out. Bump, 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 bump. Alright, so we're done with that for now. Wonderful. <sighs> Nothing else. Okay, so there's those guys, there's this. Alright. F3. Roger Your request to dock is granted. Please proceed to dock two. Wonderful, it's granted. Alright, well I guess I gotta pick a particular thing to do particular stuff then. Come on, just go there, please. There we are. So yeah, let's see if I have repairs to do now after that lovely attempt at mining, which went about as well as I should have expected, and now I know better. We just get swarmed and can't collect resources without the other stuff. So yeah, now I have repairs to do, of course. How many credits? 42. Repair complete. Hitchhiker's reference. How nice. Do I need shield batteries or anything? Let's see, did I spend any? No, I didn't. Interesting. Uh, that's cool. I still have those. 9,000 credits. Cool. Anything useful here? Class 3 Heavy Star Beam, I already have one. Ah oh, well. Interesting bunch of crap. Alright, fine then. Do I have anything here that I can use otherwise? I mean, I have all this other stuff. Eh, I don't have that. Alright. So, to the bar again. Let's see. Anyone? Eh, let's just see what's said in the listing. I don't want to bother talking to them. Difficulty 9, difficulty 8, 9, 7, 7. So, most price, any weapons plant? Yeah, weapons plant. Flat, yeah, that's not good. And there's that. This would pay the most, though. Let's see, we have word that a number of Molly ships have been identified. You are to fly to that field and engage them at once. Eliminate all hostile ships. Yeah, maybe... Oh, cool. We actually have advanced ships in the area. How oh, nice. Let's go for that one, maybe. Oh, wait. We have a scroll bar thing. Um, hmm. Level 10. We have tolerated the Mollies too long. One of their more active leaders, Michael Crawley, has been spotted. He was last seen in Sector E5, and we have reason to believe he's still there. You are hereby authorized to track him down and do the stuff. Yeah, it's only a slight bit more, but uh, doesn't seem to say that we'll have backup. So let's do this one that has 300 less credits, but less difficulty. There we go. Now the launching into the space of doom, 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 doom. Oh, uh, wonderful. But jump gates to go through. Freelancer Alpha 1 Extra this crunchy. Is Stokes Smelter. You are cleared for launch. Good luck out there. So glad I'm cleared to launch. Woo. Enemy ships will be at the mission waypoint. See the nav map for further details. It's neat how the turrets move. Hello, hello. Dancing in space with Gatling lasers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Only a few hundred space meters to go before we go however many space kilos in space. Alright, mission waypoint 59 space kilos of some doom. Not kilometers, not parsecs, something between those. Who knows what though. I mean, yeah, who knows. Anyway, it's in space. We've got to go to space and deal with this stuff in space. Space, space, space. Ah well, here's another waypoint. Where's the next one? 12k, wonderful. 
will do. But we need to start avoiding stuff and uh, be prepared to press R or escape and to change mode and R to select closest ship basically. And these are annoying little things. Just right clicking, even though it doesn't do anything because I'm bored while I'm traveling. Yay, ADHD. Not even TikTok brand ADHD. I have actual diagnosed ADHD from back when I was a kid. Yes. Enemy ships in range. We're painting them so you can ID them easily. This is where you die. I think you've got that in the reverse format. Alrighty, dudes. One dirt. To go crispy first. Hello, would you like some free doom? Free doom for everybody. Extra crispy. Oh, they're not even firing missiles at me yet. How nice. They are launching mines. You'd better just look the other way. You've got more enemies at the next waypoint. Terminate them. Kill. Yeah. And I will do that. Oh, come on. Why do they have a faster ship? Okay, so, dude. Isn't there a stupefaction agent by the name of Molly? I don't know what it is, but it's one of them. Ah, stay out of my line of sight, steer. I'd like to not do friendly fire, please. Hopefully it doesn't count if we do friendly fire, but it's like, chill with getting in front of me so much. Okay. Come on. What the heck? Another one goes, another one goes, another one bites the bus. Hey, they're gonna sit by you. Weird Al. Come on. Yay, more free stuff to sell to the free ports of doom. Okay, Solomon, sorry for all the chicks you know. Think you're a real wise guy flying away from me, do you? You do? Is it me? Am I your friend? Do you miss me? Come on. Let's go. You need to be nice and toasty. And I'm here to help. Not necessarily you, but I am here to help. Yep. Crispy. Yeah, you have. And now you're toast. Congratulations. Alright, one more, then another. Come on. Time to go toasty. Extra crispy. The enemies are who slowed down. I finally found a lead that might help us find Professor Quintain. Meet me on Cambridge. I'll be waiting for you in the bar. Oh, joy. 
All right, so mission waypoint. We have another mission of the main thing of doom. Cambridge, she said. Do they want to do analytics and try to program us? Wait, what station's that? LD14? Is it going to be another one that's going to be angry at us in a moment? Like we find we just have to... Wait, was that the one I was at just a moment ago or is that a different one? Well, here's hoping I don't have to fight 50 trillion pirates right as I try to enter the Stargate again. Had enough of that already. But I think I'm just going to get to Cambridge. Or I don't know, I might get the cutscene before that. Have the cutscenes at the end so everyone has to watch if they're going to bother. Would be nice. It's nice to actually potentially be able to afford food. And who knows when I might be homeless next. And to actually have to be able to afford a motel occasionally to shower. That'll be fun. I haven't had running water for three years here either, but... Oh well. What else is there to do though? Oh well. I do sort of have permission to use the showers at my sister's main house, but it's kind of like, uh, you know, seldom sit foot in your neighbor's house lest they hit you kind of thing. So, yeah. Anyway. And they already hate me anyway. So, whatever. I just can't make anything work on my own. It's always been that way. You just get to be a household slave as a kid, and thrown out as soon as I'm useless for the survivor's benefits and all that for sort of stuff. So, whoop de doo Dog. Well, my dad did try to teach me things like working on construction sites and how to drive a car in an emergency and how to repair VCRs and electronics somewhat but yeah after he passed away it was just really depressing and then getting attacked all the time by my stepdad when he was like super angry during the first few years he was there that was a joy and not having a driver's license because they didn't want me to own a car they didn't want me to have the ability to travel either generally that was fun but yeah I was put in public school for like three months I was homeschooled for most of my life but uh, plopped into public school because I couldn't focus on my studies for a bit like between all the attacking by my stepdad and otherwise just being depressed I just couldn't focus on anything so yeah whatever though Dog. almost to Cambridge sector I guess we're going to a different sector leads to New London okay <laughs> yeah, life can be fun sometimes and you just can't make everything work and everyone who's had a more easy situation where they're actually supported in what they do and not constantly sabotaged seems to be like, oh, you just need to do this or you're lazy. It's like, just this, just this, just this, just this, and just this, and just this, and just this, and just this, 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 and face infinite rejection and it's still all dependent on the actions of others around you as to whether or not they sabotage your life or they help you to survive and it's like really what's fun too is you know, it's like some of the charities are not really about actually helping those that need help they're about 
helping them just enough to take pictures for their marketing campaigns because the goal of most of them is just bloating the administrative staff, especially the top ones. But yeah, yeah it's like giving a three-step ladder for a ten-step pit that they keep everyone in. And it's not particularly just the charities doing that kind of crap. Oh, come on. Already this stuff? Well, time to focus on more than just my own grief. Time for more experience points of doom. Freaking crap in front of me everywhere. And I have bad guys behind me making lineups. So that's fun. Ah, the joy. At least they have more to focus on. 47 remaining. I'm gonna chill out. Trying not to accidentally shoot the station or weapons platforms of the better things. It's difficult to see. Trying to wait until I hear incoming missile to release the chaff. these things. Oh, up to there now for that one in particular. Come on. Come on. Would be nice if it released it automatically, but I guess after a point it would just be the game playing itself and that would be silly. Like what would even be the point in that? But yeah, for actual fighters, you probably would want automated countermeasures rather than stupid ones that require distraction from providing doom for the enemies in the game. Oh, chill out. Stop exiting. Stop exiting. Yes. Congrats on actually realizing you're under attack. Chill out. <sighs> come on, come on, no get up in orbit, yeah. Never more doom. And I'm uploading this to the 20th in October. A couple days from when it's there, it'll be my 39th birthday. And I still haven't got my freaking life in order. Hopefully I'm still alive by then and not homeless or gone otherwise. Hopefully my birds are still with me and I'm not <sighs> having them stolen from me as well. They've been my family longer than most of my family has been in my life. Are we done with this? Good. Onward to the next waypoint. Cool. Go to Doc. Alright. Good. Finally. Good. Grief. Just a never ending bucket of space pirates. <sighs> you know what's fun is like when everyone gives rules that they don't really mean or they say things that they don't mean. Yeah, I don't really appreciate lying. It's like, okay. And seriously, I can almost afford, you know, surviving with just buying beans for about 20 bucks a week or so. Although, it does get rather tiresome with meal fatigue if it is just the same stuff over and over. I need to get grains and legumes and some veggies to put in there, so it's closer to maybe like 30 bucks a, a week for that. And that's a joy. At least while I'm not having to pay other crap yet. 
who knows if we'll be stuck with that soon. It's just impossible after a point. Can we just go... Where? Okay, not there, I guess. Where are we going? To there. This is Bretonia Police, Omega 15 to Freelancer Alpha 1 1. You will submit to a cargo scan. Okay. And what? Well, you're clear. I didn't find anything. Thank you. So much. Oh, my word. 74 kilo space things. My word. Well, here we go. Some more. Onward to the main mission questline thing of doom. And probably getting disrupted in transit. Even though... I don't know how it would work for this type of FTL, but apparently they can disrupt your travel, which is annoying, to say the least. Alright, another thing. Oh, come on, more of these jerks. Oh, come on. Reactor leak. Oh, my word. Bum 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 bum! Extra crispy, extra crunchy. Okay. You will not, I guarantee it. Because you don't actually try to leave, you just complain about it while you get crispy. Which is how it's built in the game. Yeah, hello there. Where are you? Anyone else here? I guess we're out of stuff. Okay. Dog. Oh my word. That was pain. Ever more freaking stuff to do. Alright, to Cambridge we go. Alright. Oh well, so should I complain more about my crappy life that no one cares about? If you want, feel free to sign up to my Patreon and send a dollar or so. I only have, well one friend uh, is sending me five dollars, hopefully that's still a thing. Hopefully I've also published my book by now, though I'll be waiting for advice from my editor and I kind of get tired whenever I have more advice to follow, so I don't know. That's always fun too. So, Corsairs, yay. Ah, the joy. Come on, stop moving. Go crispy. Come on. Stop moving. Ah, stop. They just will not stop moving. Stop! Stop moving! Why must you exist? Okay, where's the next one? Or wait, did I still didn't get that one yet? No, I did. Okay, cool. Now the next one, finally. Uh, shields are almost down while waiting to get this thing. Come on! They are just super maneuverable. Yeah, well, stop moving. <sighs> Come on! How many freaking Corsairs? Or Mollies or whatever else. Come on! Yeah, sorry about that, but your time is over. Come on, stop. You do now. 
Thanks so much. So am I. Come on, stop moving. Stop existing. Stop existing. Come on. Go kiss it. And another one. Hello there. Would you like some more doom? Free doom. Seems not as effective when we're a few hundred out, unless they're going in a straight line. And of course they have to zigzag all over the place like the demons in Tachyon. Good, stop holding it. Go crispy. Sorry lady. You wanted to fight me, eh? Now you've been fought. There we go. Finally. Done with that. Good grief. Yeah, I'm just gonna go to the planet, I think. Maybe do the cutscene, but I might save the cutscene for the next thing rather than bother. Let's see, it's meet Junie in the bar on planet Cambridge. So yeah, I'll, I'll land on Cambridge to do the repairs. I don't know if I'll do the cutscene at the end. It might be better to save it for the beginning of the next one. Which will be after my birthday. Which now everyone's going to be trying to go and steal from me since they know approximately when my birthday is. It's only happened a couple times that you'd think that it's so perfect to do that kind of crap. It's like, really? I, I have $6.32. Hopefully I'll get paid and be able to afford groceries this week. I'll have to beg my stepdad, who is actually willing to help me get my cell phone going. So I'll be able to have an Amazon account and not lose it the next... Like, I lost it the last time because uh, my, I prioritized food. I wasn't getting paid enough for the reviews and whatnot I was doing. And I couldn't... You know, it's difficult to figure out things to say after a while. And afford things to buy that cost less than you get paid. But yeah, let's see here. Come on. I need to switch faster. Okay, well they're done with that. Good. Now I don't have to do that. Cool. But yeah, the two-factor verification crap that requires you to keep your phone on Amazon, that had it where you don't afford your phone long enough and someone takes it from you, it's given to someone else, and then suddenly it's verified to someone else's phone, and that's just silly. Oh, this is cool. I like the landscape here way better. Probably still have the freaking gargoyles, but... Well, it looks nicer on this for portion of it at least. And yep, we have repairs to do, so let's repair. Let's see. Yep, all the gargoyles. The cartoon gargoyles was okay, but uh, yeah, I don't like them though. That whatever. 702. Repair complete. Yay. Okay, and let's make sure we have the flares and shield batteries before we start the next run. But yeah. Gotta do it. Oh, Chicago. we still have the rest. I guess we got a fair chunk from the other thing. Um, where's there we go. So we still need only ten. I guess we must Chicago. have been picking those up also. Skyrail class four. I don't know. Those are slow. Faster rate of fire things tend to be better for dealing doom faster at least. All damage for top 94. Shield damage 47. Hmm, interesting. Ah, oh, well, let's not do this right now. I think I'm gonna be done. And yeah, let's do the cutscene now. Loading. Here's Junie. She doesn't have a shoe on her head, though. I was wondering when you'd show. Did you find Quintain? That's the thing. The good doctor has disappeared. You mean like the others? No, not like them. This one left a trail, but I'm gonna need your help, Trent. 
Are you with me? Okay, Juni has a lead that might shed some light on the whereabouts of Professor Quintain. He is the key to learning more about the alien artifact difficulty. Since this is not an official LSF mission, there is no LSF intel data available. Reward valuable information about the mysterious alien artifact. Sure. I clicked accept. Oh, here's hoping it's not another. So I'm here. Count me in. Good. What do you know about Xeno archaeology? Not much. Why? Just let me do the talking. Whatever you do, keep that artifact out of sight. I don't want to repeat performance in Manhattan. Anything else? Yeah. Bring the bottle. Very nice of you to see us on such short notice, Mr. Vance. When you said in your message that you and Dr. Trent were from the Hammer Research Institute in Liberty, I could hardly refuse. It's not entirely unusual for Dr. Quintain to miss an appointment now and then, even one regarding funding. We understand. We made it quite a while ago. I'm just pleased the university put me in touch with you. I do a lot of work for Dr. Quintain, shuttling people and equipment back and forth to his research sites. I'm sorry, usually I can find him, but... You mean you don't know where he is? He doesn't know where he is. Ouch. Oh, he hasn't been around for weeks. Probably doing deep research. He doesn't always tell us. Dr. Sinclair doesn't even know where he is. Have you spoken to her yet? No. She's been doing field work for the professor for years. Has she? Do you think she'd mind if we looked her up? No. Funding is what these scientists live for. Well, that and a little recognition, of course. Of course. Can you tell us where Dr. Sinclair is now? Sprague. I'm afraid I can't get her a message, though. It's too far out. That's all right. We'll go to her. You've been very helpful, Mr. Vance. Thank you. And I think Dr. Sinclair will be quite pleased. Last week, nothing. This week, you and the Rhinelanders. What Rhinelanders? From the New Berlin Museum. They're also very interested in their work. You just missed them. Uh-oh. We gotta move. Get whatever you need here on Cambridge and meet me in space. Don't take too long, Doctor. I won't. <laughs> Academics. Okay, well, time to call it a day. See about finding out the gossip and all that stuff later. But, anyway. Save early, save often. Well, as often as we can. We can't while we're in space. But, here we go going now. Here we are. Take care everyone. Try not to go crazy. And beware. The space hamsters. The space hamsters of doom. Doom, doom, doom.